you. We're going to tie a hair's ear. Super generic pattern. This is a flashback hair's ear. So we're going to have uh, our flash going from back of the fly all the way up. For the fit, uh, tailing fibers here, you can use like guard hairs from a hair's mask, but I'm going to use uh, bleached pheasant. Just a little quicker. We're going to tie that in. We're going to lock that in all the way up to the bead so we have a nice even taper. Go ahead and clip your excess. These work well like, you know, early spring. Uh, I fished these down to a, to a 20. Sometimes I don't opt for the flash. Certain rivers, you know, I like I like the flashback uh, pheasant and uh, hare's ears. Where in other conditions, you know, uh, leaving out the flash and having it more drab is better. Uh, but I do find on certain rivers, like they really favor the flashback for whatever reason more so than you know, a drab and vice versa. So I tied in some gold wire and also some uh, Lurex all the way back. And then I'm going to take my hair's ear dub and I'm going to dub a really tight dubbing loop um, noodle here. You don't want this bulky towards the back of the fly. Let's go ahead and bring that forward, tight wraps. You can invert the fly here and then you can uh, start bringing your wire forward. You can lock that off as well. And get rid of the excess. I'm going to get rid of this this Lurex here because um, it was small, and that's what you want. But when I'm doing the wing case, I want to go to uh, step up in size. So we're going to tie that in as a wing case here. We're going to go ahead and uh, dub again here. Uh, this time you want it to be uh, to be spiky so you don't you don't have to get super tight here. And just before you pull, you know, you pull your wing case forward, really make sure you kind of have uh, the taper silhouette you're looking for. Go ahead and lock off just a couple turns and then in front of the flash go ahead and trim your flash quick whip that's it trim the guard hairs if you need to and uh, tie these in different sizes substitute bead color but with hair's ear I tend to like the uh, the gold silver sometimes good luck